with some news about hacking and cybersecurity. A 20-year-old man has admitted to police that he was behind one of Germany's biggest data breaches in which the private details of almost a thousand public figures were leaked. The young man, who lives with his parents and is still in the education system, told police he had acted alone and was not politically motivated. He told investigators he had been driven instead by his annoyance at statements made by the victims of his attacks, including politicians, journalists and leading celebrities. Do you realize this? Someone who is still a student is able to inflict quite a lot of damage online. This is not an old movie like Wargame, it's real. The Interior Minister, Horst Seehofer, revealed that the hacker would not have been able to gather as much data as he had if his victims had created more sophisticated passwords. And as you already know, your passwords are very important. That is why they should be hard to guess for an attacker, but easy for you to remember. I'll add a link to a good article about this in the description of the video. So, the minister said, bad passwords were one of the reasons he had it so easy. I was shocked at how simple most passwords were, I quote, I love you, one, two, three, a whole array of really simple things. So, if you have one of these, change it now. But of course, you guys know better than these celebrities, right? <laughs> I hope so. Anyway, Seehofer said that both politicians and the public needed to greatly increase their sensitivity towards cybersecurity, saying such attacks would likely become more commonplace. More and more of those guys we're gonna get. So he announced the recruitment of hundreds more cybersecurity experts to the police force, as well as the setting up of a round the clock IT team who will use early warning system to both prevent and recognize such attacks. You mean Germany didn't have that yet? Yes, you would be surprised how even some of the world's leading economies are almost naked in front of hackers. The hacker, who used the pseudonym GOAT and ORBIT, so poetic, was arrested on Sunday. On Monday, he confessed to the cyber attack, prosecutors said. He's accused of spying, leaking data, and the unwarranted publication of personal data. But how did they find him? Investigators traced the man through digital trust he left on the internet as well as by speaking to witnesses, including a 19-year-old with whom the hacker had communicated via an encrypted messaging service. So, even if you use security tools and apps, you should also ask yourself, do I really trust this person I'm sending information to? The hacker told the other guy he had destroyed his computer to avoid detection, but police said they had recovered extensive evidence. The breach only came to light last Thursday, although the data Everything from private telephone numbers to email correspondence and family photographs had been released in the style of an advent calendar on Twitter between the 1st and 24th of December. First came details from the private accounts of TV stars and YouTube stars, followed by data belonging to hundreds of politicians, including the Chancellor, Angela Merkel, and the German President, Frank Walter Steinmeier. Imagine if we were to release private information of some of the politicians in other countries. Crazy, right? So keep in mind that even a 20 year old could hack your account. So please subscribe so you can stay informed about all the news about hacking and cybersecurity. And remember, be safe online and offline. We'll see you soon.